complete without a trip to the fairground. The streams on the rocks and a sweet smell of candy floss make it a great day out for everybody. But this iconic British pastime could be under threat as rising costs means that for many fun fairs, keeping the show on the road is now tougher than ever. Some of these rides date back as far as the 1890s. The Carter family bought their first vintage steamboat 45 years ago and have been entertaining the nation ever since. But the cost of living crisis has forced owner Joby to make the tough decision to shut down the family business. We started travelling in 1977 when I was just a, a toddler. I started full time the minute I left school. I was doing the Carter. Give me an idea about some of the costs that have gone up. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Not crazy, he was all over him. Oh, my leg! That's what you expect. It's not just the price of the energy, which is more rigid. I don't know if it's not on a date. I do prefer people with more hair. I'm not going to lie to you. Right, let's bring the tone down a little bit. Running costs. Give me an idea of what it was like a few years ago compared to now. Only this time last year, we were paying about eight pounds for a bag of coal. Yes. We used about ten bags on both steam, both off steam. The tell you we had our electric bill.